you want to be a content creator go ahead and watch this video all the way through i'm going to drop some gems on you that i wish somebody would have told me before i started creating content let's jump right in this is going to be the four things you need to do before you become a content creator and i'm going to be looking down because i am using my digital planner i made my notes in there and i'm going to be reading off that the first thing first which no one told me about is you're a content creator you created the content and now you're getting paid and you're getting offers but you don't know how to send the invoice or you don't know how to get paid don't let them just say, oh, we'll pay you this type of way. No, you set the terms and you send the invoice to the company that you're, um, you know, that you're going to collab with. So the first thing is first, get a business PayPal. I say a business PayPal because you want this money separate from your personal account. Because one, you're going to have to pay um, taxes on that TikTok money or that YouTube money or that Instagram money. Don't let them girlies tell you you don't got to pay them taxes because you too, boo, boo. So send all your invoices through paypal keep it consolidated into one app i use paypal it's free and then you can create a business account and then you can send the invoice to the person that you're collaborating with uh, for me in the future i'm going to send an invoice to fenty because i'm going to work for fenty period and uh, so all you have to do is create the invoice put their email in and send that invoice to them and you can select the days that they need to pay it on to as well so do paypal there's lots of videos on how to do that but if you would like me to create a video on it girl that's gonna charge you extra you're gonna have to watch my whole video and then go watch another video <laughs> i'm just kidding but i'll tell you i could do a video on that like if you guys want that the second thing is you need to create a business email so i have my personal email and then i have my business email all my collaborations go through my business email i do not put it in my personal email although they do know my real name because a lot of people they just think my name is lynn but my name is luminous lynn on my social medias however that is not my name <laughs> No, ma'am. I'm a secret. You can't, you can't find out my real name, which I'm pretty sure you, all of you have known already. But get a business email because it's very unprofessional. It's like you don't have a business email. You sitting there from babylicious33 at gmail.com. Girl, let's get up. Stop that. Let's get up. And then the next thing you need to do is create a portfolio. This is number three. Um, you can create a portfolio on TikTok or Instagram. I have one on Instagram, so please follow it below. I will link it down. I have like 900 followers on there, I think. However, I haven't posted any videos because I don't know exactly what I want to do with that portfolio yet. I don't know if I want to start now or just wait until I get more collaborations, but post on a portfolio. Have a portfolio and just let your work speak for itself where companies will reach out to you. The last thing is a digital media kit. You want a digital media kit. I will go on Canva and look at other people's digital media kits. I will go on TikTok to look what other people are saying, what they put in their digital media kits, because that is going to be where you say who you are, when you say what you're about and the prices that you're going to pay. Now, well, not the prices you're going to pay, the prices are you're going to charge because that is very important. If you don't have a media kit, and you're just over here throwing out random numbers, then that's gonna hurt you in the long run. So right now, like I have two companies reaching out to me. They wanted a gifted collaboration. However, I reached back out to them and let them know, hey, I, I appreciate you, like, you know, reach out to me for a gifted collab. However, I need to be paid. And then there are gonna be people who lowball you. And if you feel like you're worth more money, you don't have to accept the deal, but a digital media kit will help you with that. That's you're, you're gonna show all your work, you're gonna have all your business emails, your phone number, if you have one, um, you're gonna have links and all that in there. So I just say get a digital media kit and I will actually make two digital media kits. Uh, me personally, I have pricing that I have for small time businesses and then I have pricing that I have for big corporations. Right now, um, this month, I think I got paid or I'm going to get paid, actually not until February, um, $2,500 for four videos that I did for one company. That's $2,500. Now, another company, if they're willing to work with me for their videos, I'm willing to only charge them like $250 per video because they're a smaller business. So it's 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 what you want to do but a digital media kit is very important so if you want one for small time business creators or you want one for big corporations i recommend like so for the big corporations um when i know like i know what i can do like i know that i don't have a lot of engagement on my videos except for like 250 people but those 250 people that show up for me every time they turn the fuck I mean, they turn up for me. So that's why I'm able to get paid $2,500 for four videos because the people who have been engaging with me has 
helped me out tremendously. They they go buy the per the items that I purchased. My link tree is on fire right now. People are literally using my link tree and they're getting all the um all the things that I have linked in my link tree. And I appreciate every single one of you. Like I appreciate you guys so much. Like you just do not know when 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 I make it, you go make it too. I'm gonna have the best giveaways. I can just feel it like <laughs> I can't wait to like do an official giveaway like hey you got to watch this is my giveaway <laughs> i can't wait um but so yeah a media kit is super important and i think that that's what you need to start with first actually i'm gonna throw in a fifth one have a nice headshot get your camera put it on the settings that i told you about in my last video and take your photo like look how crystal clear this is. i'm looking at my screen right now and i can see that i'm very crystal clear and you need to get that like you you, you need to get that headshot because a lot of people think like it's okay to be like natural, be yourself, and all that other stuff because you know I I can get it both ways. Yeah, I can put a makeup and I can be the natural face. However, my headshot I have on a full face of makeup and I just very look well put together. You wouldn't know that I'm batshit crazy up here just by looking at my headshot photo. So that's another thing. Like you don't have to do that, but there's just something I do. Or you can just create yourself a logo. But that's the end of this video. I just want to make it cute and short. And if you made it this far, put a peach at the end because I just like to know who's staying in tune with me. Just put a peach emoji if you have one. Or do they have a peach emoji? I don't know. Put the sunflower emoji if you made it this far. And because I'm going to remember everybody who interacts with me in my videos when I start my giveaways. I'm going to be looking out for all of y'all. So drop a sunflower emoji if you made it to the end of this video. And thank you so much for watching. Don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe and share, please. Bye.